Hi guys, welcome back for another video. I hope you're all having a wonderful day or night, wherever you are in the world. I wanted to talk about my Bath & Body Works and Yankee Candle empties today. And when I went into my cabinet where I keep all of my empty candles, I realized I had way more than I thought I did. So I actually have quite a bit to show you, so let's do this thing. Most of these candles are Bath & Body Works. I have a couple Yankee Candle and a couple of random ones, again. Um, if you haven't seen my previous candle empties, I will put it up in the corner here. That one was my summer candle empty, so they were mostly summer candles, but this time they are mostly fall scented candles. I also did a couple fall candle hauls, so that's where most of these are from. If I have already spoken about these candles before on my channel, like a scent for example, and I've already talked about it before, then I won't go too much in depth about that particular scent, but if it's one that I haven't really talked about, then I will give a little brief description of it to you guys. So the first candle is Marshmallow Fireside. I'm sure you're all very shocked, I know. Um, this is actually a Marshmallow Fireside from last Christmas. I did want to note, I like the old winter lids. If you can see, this is like a really pretty snowflake. And um, the, the lids from the lids from this winter look like this. So um, you can see this is more of like a snowflake and this one is more of like a star. I don't know. I just really like the old lids. And I found that I like a lot of the older candle packaging. And I also, I actually finished two marshmallow firesides. So this one is um, the fall one from this year. The next candle is Caramel Pumpkin Swirl. This is like a really sweet, foody pumpkin scent for fall. I also really love this pumpkin lid. I think this is like the only pumpkin lid I have. Next is Honey Crisp Apple. This one just smells very much like apples. Here's the lid for this one. I got one this fall as well in one of my candle hauls. This one is called Leaves. Um, this is a very popular one. Everyone seems to know about this candle. This is more of like a spiced scent. Um, I have gotten this a few times, actually. It's one of my top favorite fall candles. The next one is called Cider Lane. If you guys saw one of my fall candle hauls this year, um, this is a new love for me. I am just in love with this candle. This one smells like caramel apples. This candle is called Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. Um, again, I got this in a fall candle haul. I don't know why I keep saying that. You guys can just assume that I got a lot of these for my fall candle haul. This one was kind of like a light scented candle, like, um, I believe the technical term is throw. It's, it's not very strong is what I'm trying to say. Um, so yeah, this one is a good one. I don't know if I would repurchase it though because, you know, it isn't quite so strong. So you can't really get a good feel of the scent to it. It's almost like barely there. Um, it is really nice and sweet though, if you want like a sweeter fall candle. And then I have a flannel. This one is from this year, so it's the red version. Um, actually, I kind of had a problem <laughs> with this one. It's not like the wax hasn't completely gone down. Um, it's actually because I went to light it one night and my finger actually accidentally bumped the wick. So the wick was too short and it wouldn't burn anymore. So the wicks are kind of messed up in this one. Um, I don't think it'll burn anymore, but yeah, um, it is kind of messy and dirty in there, but I just love flannel. It's a cologne type manly scent. Everyone knows about flannel. I have Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. This is another classic fall scent. This one smells just like a craft store. If you guys have ever been to like Michaels or Joanne Fabrics, like Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin smells like walking into a craft store. It's not my favorite. I know everyone absolutely loves Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin, but just kind of like a craft store scent to it isn't my favorite. It is like a good classic fall scent though. And then I also have Winter Candy Apple. This is from last year too. Um, if you'll notice like the glass for the jar, it's kind of like a shiny red glass. And um, if you guys have been to the store this season, they have like a frosted glass jar. I personally like this version better. I mean, the frosted glass is really pretty, but I think that this red is just, it just goes so well with the winter candy apple. This one is also one that doesn't have a lid. I just love winter candy apple. If you guys are familiar with my channel, you know that that's one of my favorite scents. 
The rest are Yankee Candles, so this one is called Farmer's Market. Um, this is one that Jacob and I got early, early fall. Um, this is one of the first fall candles we got this season because we really wanted to get um, like a sampling, like a little test of the new fall scents coming out. Um, this one is just like a, if you, th okay, this is kind of weird, but if you think of like your grandma's house when your grandma is burning candles, if you have a grandma that burns candles, I mean, I do. Anyways, if you, like this smells like your grandma's house when she's burning a candle on baking apple pie and she has like all her fall decorations out, like, I don't know, that's what this one smells like, if that makes any sense at all. This one is called Autumn in the Park. This is one of Yankee Candles, uh, like tradi traditional scents that they bring back a lot. It's, uh, I think this is called a tall tumbler or a large tumbler or something like that. Uh, yeah, this one just smells like leaves and a little bit like apple and cinnamon. It's a really good fall scent. I kind of like this style, the jar, how it's tall like that. It did take me a while to get through this one, though. It took me a couple of years to get through this one. I actually just put up a video about um, some Yankee Candle winter scents. If you guys haven't seen that, it'll be up in the corner here. Um, so this is one of my suggestions for a Christmas candle or holiday candle from Yankee. Um, this is called Sparkling Balsam. And actually, like, a day or so afterward... <laughs> this one burnt out so um, if that's any indication of how much I love it you know it's kind of got like that fresh um, almost like menthol-y feeling to it last but not least I have another uh, cheap glade candle these do get like super gross that's one of the things I don't like about these it gets really bad around the top by the end of the candle and they burn through really really quickly this one is called um, pumpkin Pit? No, Pumpkin Pit Stop. That's what it's called. It actually smelled really good. This scent was amazing. It just smells like pumpkins and or pumpkin pie. It's, it's actually a very good scent for the price. These are cheap. You can find them at Walmart. I also have like the Glade plug-in and Jacob walked in one day when I was using it and he was like, oh my god, what is that? That smells so great. Is that a Bath and Body Works skin? And I'm like, no, it's actually Glade. So, you know, that's Another good example of a affordable, good candle. So those are all of my candle empties. I think I had, let's see, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14. 14 empty candles. That is a lot, in my opinion. Um, but I feel like it's better to actually use up my candles than to be the kind of person who just has tons and tons of candles laying around unused. At least this way I know I get my money's worth. So if you guys love any of these candles leave a comment down below telling me which scents are your favorite from bath and body works um if you guys have any candle recommendations let me know or any questions um i actually had someone comment on a video the other day asking for suggestions for like body sprays or candles for a certain season so if you guys have any questions or if you want any recommendations from me feel free to ask me like this video if you enjoyed it or found it helpful, and make sure to subscribe to my channel to be notified every time I put up something new. I upload new videos every single week, so be on the lookout for those, and until my next video, I will see you guys soon. Bye guys! What do you guys think of my holiday, Christmassy background? I know it's not super decorated, but... Um, I have this adorable little countdown to Christmas. This is from Michael's, if you guys are wondering. But it's so cute. The little, um, the little cubes come out to, uh, change the number of how many days. It's so cute. So this guy will probably be hanging out in the background of my winter videos this year. Um, and then I've got, uh, winter mint and spruce burning in the background. And then these are... The stockings. This is little Dookie stocking. It's so cute. <laughs> Love it. <laughs>